Hello lovelies, it's Lex and I have another speed build for you. So I wanted to do a couple of base game builds lately because uh, my best friend Nikki just got the uh, Sims game, Sims 4, so she doesn't have um, a lot of the packs. Well really she doesn't have any of the packs except for the toddlers update and any of the free stuff that they've given us. So I wanted to make a couple of base game builds so that people like her that don't have all of the junk like I do would still be able to get some rooms. So this is a base game family style kitchen uh, and I ended up putting a high chair in here as well but if you've downloaded the room you'll notice that the position of the high chair and the garbage can are different than what they are in this build and that's uh, because whenever I went to play test it it didn't want to work properly so they work fine now I just had to play with them a little bit to get them to work so I ended up doing a like really light sagey kind of Robin's eggy blue color in this and then in the uh, kitchen kitchen portion it's just white tile uh, all white cabinets white appliances and then a uh, lighter tan kind of color on the top of the wall and then that really dark blue uh, marbly looking backsplash so I thought that that looked really nice and then we have a little bit of island seating and then a six person dining table so so there's lots of seating in this room if your sims happen to have a large family or they're having a get together party kind of thing you're gonna have like you know the six table seats two island seats there's a high chair for baby like there's there's a there's a pretty decent amount of seating and space in this kitchen which is nice it has a little bit of clutter but not a ton I think it was just enough to kind of fill out the room uh, really there isn't really a ton of accent colors in this I guess the accent color would be white and then I have like that little bit of purple on the rug underneath the table a uh, move objects is turned on for for this uh, this cheat for this room but it's really just for the rug there isn't really a ton of stuff I have in here that you would need the move objects cheat on for besides the rug and like the vent fan kind of thing that I have above the stove because there isn't a lot of random clutter in here I wanted to use one of these pot racks so I ended up putting it over the island counter and then I'll go into build mode here. Sometimes I like to put columns on either side of the island counters to make it look like the pot rack is kind of supported by something. But because this is a base game, all of the columns are really large and looked really out of place in the room. So I ended up not putting one up. Here's a little bit of wall clutter for you. And then I'm going to end up putting an accent table on the one far wall with a little bit more clutter, a plant, and then a picture above it. But that's about it for this speed build. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a fantastic rest of your day and thank you so much for watching as always please feel free to leave me suggestions in the comments below for sims builds you like to see games you're interested in any questions you have for me about building and i will see everybody in the next video